You talk to your dog every day, asking how they are, venting about work, maybe even sharing secrets. But have you ever stopped to wonder? What does your dog actually hear when you speak? Those tilted heads, soft eyes, and wagging tails aren't random. Inside your dog's brain, something incredible happens the moment you open your mouth. Today, you'll discover the science behind how dogs process your voice, decode your emotions, and even use your tone to heal themselves. This isn't just cute behavior. It's real communication, and it's more powerful than you think. 1. Your dog's brain lights up when you speak. When you talk, your dog's brain doesn't just hear, it reacts. Studies using MRI scans show that dogs process human speech in ways that are surprisingly similar to small children. The left hemisphere decodes words, while the right hemisphere focuses on tone and emotion. But what's even more fascinating is their ability to focus on your voice, even in noisy environments. Scientists call this the cocktail party effect. Your dog filters out other sounds and locks onto the familiar frequencies of your speech. It's not just background noise to them, it's you, and their brain knows it. Hearing your voice activates reward centers, triggering feelings of safety, comfort, and sometimes excitement, even before you say anything meaningful. So the next time you start rambling to your dog about your day, just know they're listening on a much deeper level than you think. Two, word recognition. Your dog knows more than you think. While most people believe dogs only understand a handful of basic commands, research shows they can recognize dozens, even hundreds of words, especially when those words are linked to consistent actions or emotions. Border collies like Chaser have memorized over 1,000 nouns. But even everyday dogs living in normal homes build their own vocabulary maps. Words like walk, treat, outside, or even your own name trigger real recognition in their brains. And here's the key. It's not just the word. It's context, tone, and repetition. Your dog doesn't just memorize sounds. They connect those sounds to experiences, places, and emotions. So when you say, want to go for a walk, they don't just hear noise. They hear possibility, joy, and bonding all in one sentence. They don't just understand commands, they understand connection. Before we go on, if you love dogs, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to join our community of dog lovers. Three, why your high-pitched dog voice actually works. You know that silly high-pitched voice you use when talking to your dog? Science says, keep doing it. Researchers have found that dogs respond far better to dog-directed speech, that exaggerated emotional tone we naturally use with babies and pets, than to regular adult conversation. But here's the twist. It only works if it comes from you. When strangers use the same pitch, dogs often ignore it. But your voice? That's different. Why? Because over time, your dog has formed strong neural associations between your unique vocal patterns and feelings of love, safety, and attention. The pitch you use isn't just cute. It's a biological bonding tool. That high tone stimulates areas in your dog's brain tied to attachment, similar to how puppies bond with their mothers. So yes, talking like a cartoon character may feel ridiculous, but to your dog, it sounds like home. Four, your emotions. Travel through your voice. Your dog doesn't just hear what you say, they feel how you say it. When you speak, subtle shifts in tone, rhythm, and pitch carry emotional signals that your dog's brain is specially wired to detect. According to researchers, dogs can sense stress, sadness, joy, and calm just from the way your voice sounds, often before you're even aware of what you're feeling. Your anxious tone, it triggers their anxiety. Your relaxed, happy voice, it releases oxytocin, the same hormone responsible for bonding in both humans and dogs. This emotional sinking is why your dog may approach you when you're upset or mirror your energy during tense moments. Your voice becomes a kind of emotional current, flowing directly into their nervous system. Five, 
Why your dog reacts differently after time apart. Ever notice how your dog responds more intensely when you speak after being away, even for just a few hours? That's no coincidence. Studies show that after periods of separation, your dog's brain becomes more sensitive to the sound of your voice. It's like their emotional radar turns up the volume just for you. When you say good morning or walk through the door and speak, you're triggering a neurological reunion, one that activates their brain's reward centers and reinforces feelings of safety. This response is rooted in survival behavior. In the wild, pack members vocalize after separation to rebuild connection and re-establish trust. So your dog's over-the-top excitement when you talk after being gone, it's not just happiness. It's an instinctive, heartfelt response to the sound of your voice. Their signal that everything is okay again. Six, how your dog locates your voice with precision. You call your dog from another room, no treats, no squeaky toy, just your voice. And somehow they come trotting in like they've got GPS. That's because they do in their ears. Dogs have over 18 muscles per ear, allowing them to tilt, rotate, and pinpoint the exact location of your voice with astounding precision, even through walls, doors, and background noise. It's not just about hearing volume. It's about directional hearing and frequency filtering. Your dog's brain prioritizes your voice over most environmental sounds, especially if it's tied to past rewards or emotional moments. And here's the wild part. When your dog ignores your call, it's not because they didn't hear you. Science confirms they absolutely did. They're just choosing not to respond. In other words, your dog isn't hard of hearing. They're just selectively obedient. Seven, everyday talk builds lifelong learning. You might think casual chatter with your dog doesn't matter, but it does. When you talk while cooking, walking around, or doing chores, your dog's brain is quietly at work, linking your words to actions, emotions, and routines. Researchers have found that dogs retain words more effectively when they're spoken during movement-based or emotionally charged moments. For example, saying dinner while preparing food creates stronger memory connections than saying it while sitting still. That's because your voice plus movement equals multi-sensory learning. Even phrases like let's go or want to play become powerful cues, not just because of repetition, but because they're tied to emotion and timing. Your dog is always learning from your tone, timing, and daily rhythm. Eight, your voice can literally heal your dog. What if your voice wasn't just comforting, but therapeutic? Recent studies show that calm, rhythmic speech from a trusted human can reduce a dog's stress hormone, cortisol, by up to 50%. Just 10 minutes of soothing conversation can lower their heart rate, improve digestion, and even boost immune response. In fact, animal therapists now use guided voice therapy sessions with anxious or traumatized dogs, and they often outperform medication in long-term effectiveness. Your voice becomes a kind of biological regulator, helping your dog return to a calm, balanced state. This is especially powerful for dogs with separation anxiety, trauma histories, or chronic stress. To them, your voice isn't just sound, it's safety. Now tell us, what's one word or phrase your dog understands perfectly? And how do they react when you say it? We'd love to hear your stories in the comments. And before you go, check out our latest video to keep discovering interesting facts about the amazing world of dogs. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the comments and in the next video.